Hello everyone, please welcome and join me Easy Steps Cooking. Please click on the bell icon. You will get all the notification of my new videos and let's get started. Today, I'm going to share with you very tasty and delicious dessert recipe. I'm going to make Samia custard and it's very tasty, very easy to make. In English, we call these vermicelli. These are roasted vermicelli and this is a whole pack and this is 150 gram and I'm going to use a half of it. This is a half of it. I'm using it. This is the custard I'm going to use and it's a vanilla flavor. Four cup regular meal. Other ingredients we're going to need. Two tablespoon vanilla custard. Three tablespoon sugar. Sugar is always to taste. If you need more sweeter then add more. Otherwise three tablespoon is perfect. These are the dry nuts I'm going to use. Pistachios. Almonds, cashews, char mugs, and this is a green cardamom, alachi, and raisins, along with saffron. So we're going to use some strands of saffron, and these dry nuts, I'm going to put it into the mortar and pastel, and we're going to break it into smaller pieces. Quarter cup milk, it's a cold milk, and we're going to add custard inside. Then with the help of spoon, we're going to mix it well. So we're going to make sure that it's nicely combined. This is a custard color. We haven't added anything. So let's start making our delicious Samia custard. Get a pot and we're going to start gas. First we're going to add milk. As we added the milk, we're going to bring the milk to boil along with saffron. And as it heats up, it will release all the nice color. Make sure that we're going to mix it. Keep stirring so that the milk don't get burned at the bottom. I'll add almonds, pistachios, cashews. We're going to break it into smaller pieces. Just uh, small enough so that we can uh, roast it and they will taste better. And I will take these out. And as for char mugs, we're going to leave it as is. I'll take it out. And if there is any big ones, we can take them out again and we can break them open. This is all we need. As for a lychee, the green cardamom, that we're going to make it really smooth, powdery. So make sure that you do it nice, smooth. So when we're going to eat it, then you can enjoy it. As the milk is heating up, and uh, we're going to start another gas, and we're going to get the fry pan. These are the nut, we're going to roast them, and char mugs on low gas just cook them for like a one to two minutes once they get roasted we'll take them out only reason i'm doing it when we're going to add into our custard they're going to taste better and this is how our milk looks as you see the milk started to boil and now bring your gas on a medium as you see this is uh, all the color from saffron we haven't added any other thing and for it to adding custard we're going to mix it all one more time and now I'm going to keep adding and keep mixing, just like this. So keep adding slowly, slowly and keep mixing. Once it's nicely combined, now I will bring Samia. These are, as I shown to you, these are roasted vermicelli. Now we're going to cook it for five minutes on medium gas so keep it moving and keep cooking cooking for five minutes this is how the same young custard look and now we're going to add sugar raisins alachi powder cardamom powder dry nuts these we roasted it and now we're going to mix it again and now we just need like a half minute of cooking once uh, the sugar is nicely dissolved samia custard is all ready this one has really nice aroma with the keser which is the saffron please try it and you're going to like it it's fully cooked so i'm going to turn off the gas i have my serving bowl ready and we're going to dish out this is very delicious and quick and easy dessert recipe And let me share with you. Our tasty and delicious Samia custard is all ready. And prior to serving, garnish with some more pistachios. 
very tasty and very delicious please try it and you're going to like it if you like this recipe like always like share and subscribe easy steps cooking thank you and have a good day bye bye